Hey YouTube, this is Tehacker13, and in this tutorial I'll be showing you on how to enable the home screen wallpaper and multitasking on your iPod Touch 2G or iPhone 3G. So basically, those two features, which are really good features um, that come with iOS 4, only come with the newer devices and don't work for an iPod Touch 2G or iPhone 3G. But in this video, I'll be showing you on how to get those features, like I said, if you have one of those two devices. And it's really easy, but so if you jailbroke with jailbreakme.com, you would know that you don't have the option to enable those two features. Like in Red Snow and Snow Breeze, you had an option to enable them. But unfortunately with jailbreakme.com, you didn't. So in this video, I'll be showing you on how to get them directly from Cydia. But before we get on to the tutorial, I just want to say two things. First off, remember to please subscribe to my second YouTube channel. I just created it. It's called Other to Hacker 13. You should see some text on the screen right now showing you like the link. And so basically it's called Other to Hacker 13. I just made it for like random tech videos and you know just anything related to tech. And so and maybe a few unboxings and there will also be a link at the very top of the description. So remember to go to that YouTube channel and just click the subscribe button. And second, also please follow me on Twitter. You should see some new text on the screen showing you my Twitter link, and there will also be a link in the description down below. So remember to visit my Twitter page and hit follow. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, please thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and subscribe. Now that we've gotten all that out of the way, let's get on to the tutorial. Alright, so as you guys can currently see, I do not have a back screen, um, home screen wallpaper, and I don't have um, multitasking, as you can see, I press the home button. And so, well, double tap, nothing comes up. So first you want to do is open up Cydia, and you want everything to load, and this is all in Winterboard, alright, so you will need Winterboard to do this, because it you enable those features through Winterboard, which I actually think is really cool, but then if someone ever screws with your device then they can just um, deselect those features but then you always can re-enable them so I'll come back when everything has loaded in Cydia alright so once everything is loaded you do not have to add any sources to get this but you just want to touch search touch the uh, search bar and you want to search features So just search that and you should see this it should say from mod my eye just forget this repo right here but you should see two things from mod my eye one is features for iPod 2G and one is features for iPhone 3G so you install either one whichever device you have so you just touch it and I already have it installed but you just hit install and if you don't already have winterboard it will automatically install it but if you already do have Winterboard, then it will just download this and it may download a few other things. But once you install this and you have Winterboard, you can go to your home screen. You can open up Winterboard. You want to select themes. And you want to select wallpaper, wallpaper, comma, multitasking. I don't know um, about those because I tried them and they didn't work. Just select the wallpaper, comma, multitasking. And sorry about that. And you definitely need to select white icon labels because with the wallpaper, um, the home screen wallpaper, it makes all the um, icon text, um, the text for each application, it turns gray and it's really hard to see. So remember to select both of those. And you, you can press the home screen, and your iPod Touch or iPhone should respring. And once it has, you can slide to unlock. And you should see the background on the wallpaper. And I'll open a few apps. Settings. Open up notes. And I'll double tap the home button. And as you can see, I have multitasking. Which this is really cool. So if you guys enjoyed the video or the video worked for you, 
please remember to thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and also subscribe, like I already said. And also please subscribe to my second YouTube channel called Other to Hacker 13 and follow me on Twitter. Thanks for watching, guys, and see you all later.